Okay, this is going to be a quick tutorial um, on how to add a world space clickable button um, in this package, which is a MMORPG camera controller. And essentially all we're doing is adding a button into world space. Notice we can walk around and when we click on it, it disappears. So uh, by default, this package um, gives you all these default, um, these templates. Um, so we're going to go ahead and, no, let's not save that. Let's load up. Um, you can load up any of these, but we'll load, load up preset one. Um, you can see it's here, assets, and the lower PG demo. Um, and what happens out of the box is you can walk around. I'm right-clicking and using WASD to move around. Um, it even gives us this little UI and screen space, and you, so you can see um, I'm hovering over, and so these buttons are functional. But if we want to put the UI in world space, we need some extra steps. So here's what we need to do. First off, we want to create a canvas. So we'll go to UI canvas, there we are. We want it to be in world space. Um, notice it gave us this event camera, and so that's something we're gonna need to deal with. Look, they don't give us a camera. So we'll deal with that in just a moment, but um, we also wanna clean this up for position. Since it's a world space canvas, we're gonna put this at zero, zero, just so we don't get unexpected behavior. And now let's deal with this camera. So here's our player controller that they give us. And by default, it's set to spawn own camera. Instead, we wanna do assigned camera. And now we're gonna drag in a camera. So let's make a camera. We'll call it my camera, something like that. Main camera, whatever, it doesn't really matter. And right, so now that we have a camera in the scene, we'll go back to our player controller, drag the camera onto this. And we also need to go into the canvas, and we got to drag our camera right here. So we'll drag it onto there. All right. So last, that's all. That's all the setup we need. Now you can build out your user interface under the canvas. So let's just do the same thing we did before for the demo. So we'll create a button. All right. The button is huge, absolutely huge. So we will make it 0 0.01, 0 0.01, 0 0.01, 0 0.01, 0 0.01, 0 0.01. Um, and from experimenting before, I found a good place is 25, 4, 0. All right, and so there we see our button. And um, finally, let's have our button do something. So rather than write a script and actually do something interesting, we're just going to make it disappear when you click it. So we'll come here, go to game object, and set active false. And let's click play and see if it works. Again, I'm right-clicking and dragging to look around with the camera. WASD to move forward, get close enough to the button, and click it. It disappears. Have fun.